Bell's house was uh, sold by uh, Fannie Mae. Yeah. And his lender was Bank of America. It was taken from Bank of America and owned by the house owned by Fannie Mae. Yeah. So uh, it was sold just the other day, September the 11th. Yeah. So now he tends a chance of being evicted. Instead, he's been in his home for over 30 years. Okay. Instead. So I'm, I'm here. Instead, he has a, several difficulties. They've taken advantage of him. He's been promised by several financial companies telling him that he's going to be uh, getting a loan modification in which he's paid uh, $3,000 to get a loan modification, which he's never gotten. And they told him continuously that they would help him through uh, Bank of America, which he never got that. And then he was in the hospital. He suffered a heart attack. And then they had him sign papers. And then he also went through, they had him go through a short sale. And they told him that he wouldn't qualify. And then they told him that he needed to go to a bankruptcy. Yeah. that he shouldn't have gone through. He's gone through all this thing, and he's had high blood pressure and stuff like that. I just, I'm here to support him yeah. and everybody else, so I'm just happy that they're here to support him. And what's his name again? His name is Alfred Richardson. Thank you. And so, and please, Thank I just you. urge that um, Fannie Mae will resend it back to Bank of America so he will qualify for bank, you know, for a loan modification, which he deserves to yeah. stay in his house. That's why I'm here. I'm going to continue to fight until he gets it.